How you doing guys? Welcome back. We're gonna do our devotional for today. Today we're gonna to talk about no talk, all action. We're gonna read our uh, devotional and uh, we're gonna pretty much answer a couple of questions at the end of it. Um, today's uh, reading is gonna be from Proverbs chapter 14 verse 19 all the way to 29. I repeat, Proverbs chapter 14 verse 19 all the way to 29. Under the video, there is a link that will take you on, a, on another video uh, with the reading, okay? If you don't have a Bible or pen. I read in English and Spanish, by the way. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna read about Jacob Brooks. He was an all-time leading scorer for basketball the story, in the story of the Saturday Age High School in Colorado. He led the team in scoring from his sophomore year on and he led the whole state in scoring at the 3A level when he was a senior. As the Bruins' best player, Jacob was not only target of opposing teams, he often drew criticism at that smackdown. From jealous schoolmate who wanted to uh, take him down a notch, this schoolmate will talk a big game all fall. You just wait until I come out this year, Brooks. I'm going to take a ride at you. Usually, those guys never show up for the first day of practice. They were all talk, no actions. Jacob simply let his game speak for him. On Proverbs chapter 14, verse 23 says, All hard work brings a profit, but mere talk leads only to poverty. It's especially important to remember this in the face of criticism. And when you don't see the prophet, God's word is true. And there will be a payoff. Set a positive goal today and start working towards it. You might not catch perfection, but you might catch excellence. Please, help me to answer these two questions. Why might critics keep some people from working hard? Why my critics keep some people from working hard? Second question. Have you ever seen the payoff of your hard work come in a way you weren't expecting? Ah, let me, let me repeat the question. Have you ever seen the payoff of your hard work come in a way you weren't, you weren't expecting? Remember, answer these two questions in your book and I will see you next time also there's another link for the PowerPoint of this uh, devotional God bless you guys